What's up guys, this is Zerx. Got another TDM for you guys today. This is a TDM on jungle, and I'm using the FMOS with suppressor and also dual mag, because I like having lots of ammo. And uh, I also like being silenced, but I also like ghost. So yeah, this way I can. And so yeah, if you want to sneak around like me, then you can try this build. Um, one thing, if you guys don't like TDM, just let me know. Uh, I just like getting kills, and like when I play objective game types, I just like playing the objective, and uh, that makes it pretty difficult for me to get really high kill games. I mean, it depends on the objective, but uh, in general, it's more difficult to do that when you're not playing TDM, because TDM, the objective is to kill people. So, uh, yeah, but if you guys like headquarters or, you know, demolition or domination more, then I can definitely try to get some of those gameplays up. And, uh, yeah, just let me know. So, quick update. The first episode is up um, in my new series, which is called Did You Know That? And that is an homage to Mr. Bill Nye from Bill Nye the Science Guy. This is a little show that I used to watch in elementary school and middle school, and that counted for learning. And basically, it's just maybe like one cool bit of information every episode and that just goes over some gameplay and hopefully it's stuff that you never heard of and stuff that interests you. I was also thinking about this like it could have another role. These little these little bits of information. You know, okay. So basically there are always just these awkward pauses. Um I mean when you're talking to someone that you're not really familiar with, you know, or uh you know like maybe you're just making an acquaintance. This happens a lot in uh college. Um, you just, you know, you meet people constantly, especially in the very beginning, it's just like, Jesus, uh, you're just, you're meeting people constantly, and if you have something cool to talk about on that, uh, when they have those little pauses, those little awkward pauses that nobody likes, then you just, you seem like a very interesting person, and I can, I can provide you with that. <laughs> I don't know if that's really a good reason for you to watch the series, but... Anyway, it's it's got some pretty interesting stuff. The first episode I talk about uh, some crazy science thing that I, I probably won't bring up right now just because it, it might sound a little too retarded. But uh, you should watch it, and I'll explain it better in that video. So definitely go check that out. And now I was going to segue into some more world news. And Well, okay, yeah, really quickly, China, not so subtly... <clears throat> allowed this leak recently that basically said that they're working on a new gen stealth plane. So uh, right now, I think they're on like a fourth generation stealth plane, and they were having some problems with that. But now they just released this thing that said that they were working on a fifth generation stealth plane and doing like some flight tests already. And considering how strict they are with their media, if you remember from the Olympics, uh, they were like locking down on YouTube and and uh, Google. You know, this is probably a pretty deliberate move. And honestly, when you think about, like, okay, well, China's in bed with North Korea, and there's definitely some shit about to go down with North and South Korea, like some heavy, heavy shit. Uh, you know, you start to think, like, well, is this, like, is this real? Or are they just bluffing and trying to say, like, you know, don't get on South Korea's side or we will... We will fuck shit up on your face with our new stealth bomber. Um, I don't know. That's kind of what I'm thinking this is. It, yeah. It, it seems more like a bluff and less like dick measuring, if you can understand that analogy. And, uh, yeah. I don't know. I mean, even if this isn't true, it's just... It is a scary world out there. I've just... I don't know, when you start reading about all this world news, it's like, I don't know, like Iran is getting long-range missiles from Russia, and now apparently they have the capability to strike any western capital. That's pretty scary. And when you think about, like, uh, I don't know, I'm, oh, I think, yes! <laughs> oh god, I had a feeling. I forgot about this. Um... There were just a shitload of people around my corner. I don't understand that. Why do people run in packs? It's just, it's asking for that. You know, there's like, 
these ridiculous like quad spray shits all over the I mean not like <laughs> not quad spray shits but <laughs> it's revolting um I don't know quad spray shit that's uh it's got some kind of gastrointestinal disorder I would not like a quad spray diarrhea on my face no thank you sir anyway uh what was I talking about? I was talking about serious stuff. I was talking about Iran and Russia and oh right, yeah, North and South Korea. And, you know, you you really start to think like, do I want to know all this stuff? Because I feel like I can't really do that much about it. But you know, I still gotta know. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Like, blissfully ignorant or not. If you like this, subscribe, like, comment, and bye.